This is why Zuko and Katara would have never worked out part 2. So in the first video I basically explained why Zuko would be a terrible partner, but in this one it's a little bit different. So if you didn't know, Aang and Zuko are actually related, technically. So we know that Zuko's mother is Ursa, and Ursa's grandfather is Roku, and Aang is a reincarnation of Roku, which basically makes Aang Zuko's papa. Aang literally sons this dude. Like why would Katara go for the watered down version when she can go for the OG? Come on Aang. Not only is Aang stronger, he has more clout, taller, but he's hereditarily superior. Like there are levels to this shit. And did we forget that Aang literally has the burden of the world on his shoulders? And this nigga is completely fine. Zuko on the other hand only has a single nation to worry about. And just one year into the job bro was having hallucinations. Bro started to talk to paintings. Could never be Aang bro. Could never be Aang.